Hello friends, welcome you all on your PDA education. So friends, as you know that your PDA is providing you the module in XC uh, under material science. Okay, uh, your this uh, engineering science paper ke under jo XC ka paper hai, uske under your PDA is providing you uh, theoretical module as well as test series and uh, we will also planning for micro module. Okay, and this is a very short video and in this I am going to explain you that uh, if uh, uh, phase diagram is given to you how to calculate the composition of different phases present in phase diagram okay so I will give you a little bit idea if you want more detail then you can uh, refer to our website also so here you can see determination of phase amount suppose a simple phase diagram is given okay and uh, <coughs> here you can see a temperature is given on uh, I can say y-axis and composition is given on x-axis so here you can see there is a region above this line where only liquid is present okay and this line is called liquidus line liquidus line is the line above which only liquid is present and there is a line here you can see below which only solid that is alpha is present so the line below which only solid is present is called solidus line okay and the line above which only liquid is present is called liquidus line and the region and the region where solid plus liquid is present is called I can say mushy zone okay where both are present as well as solid as well as liquid so uh, in liquid region you can tell that sir only liquid is present or in uh, solid region you can say that only solid is present but if one point is given here then how much solid out of 100 percent how much liquid is present this is the point from where question can be framed suppose b point is given okay so b point is given then for calculation of number of uh, quant uh, basically weight weight percent of phases present we will use inverse lever rule aapke paas inverse uh, lever rule is there okay lever rule is there from where questions can be framed okay so point b is given so what is the process the point b at the given composition c naught so c naught composition is given at point number b draw a horizontal line which will be which uh, this line will going to intersect liquidus line as well as solidus line at any point so corresponding to that uh, measure the composition here you can see cl component here you can see c alpha component uh, composition so aapke paas c uh, l comp uh, composition hai c alpha composition hai and c not composition hai the difference between two compositions here is r and this difference between these two compositions is s now you have to calculate the weight percent of i can say uh, weight percent of uh, suppose liquid present okay so what do you have to do this is the line this is point this is point and this is point okay and you know that this here on this side the liquid is present okay because this line is liquidus line and this line is basically solidus line okay solid is present and uh, here you can see this is r and this is s okay suppose this is small s okay this is small s suppose so that we don't confuse so we have to calculate the weight percentage of liquid so the name of ru rule is inverse lever rule so we have to calculate liquid liquid is present on the left side so we have to take the other side that is right side so on the right side there is s so take s divide by the total length of this line that is r plus s here you can see okay now s is nothing s is basically c alpha minus c naught so here you can see c alpha minus c naught divided by total is c alpha minus c l so here you can see the weight percentage of liquid okay so i hope you get the idea about this similarly if this type of phase diagram is given then you have to calculate suppose mass fraction and volume fraction at 150 degree celsius take the densities of lead tin is given Every, everything is given but we are going to discuss only about the weight percentage of alpha and beta now what is the meaning of alpha and beta in the last question we are discussing about only liquid and solid but in the solid region if two solids are present here you can see alpha and beta so this is a solid region where this solid is present but this solid is made up of by combining the two solids that is alpha and beta okay so we have to calculate that at a composition c1 which is at point b now how to calculate point b according to the temperature this is 150 degree celsius and this composition this is the point draw the horizontal line so this is a horizontal line here you can see blue line this will intersect this line and this line here 
okay and corresponding to this point the composition is c alpha and here you can see the composition is c beta okay because here you can see this is a alpha rich region this is a beta rich region okay that is why this is c beta and this is c alpha now what you are going to do suppose this is a and this is b i can see okay now you have to calculate the weight percentage of alpha so alpha is present on the left side according to inverse river rule you have to take this length this length is b so b is nothing it is c beta minus c1 okay so here you can see c beta minus c1 divided by total that is c beta minus c alpha here you can see c beta minus c alpha similarly if you talk about that we have to calculate the weight percentage of beta so beta if i talk about beta then what we have to do beta is present on this side then you have to take the opposites this opposite to this is a a is nothing c1 minus c alpha so c1 minus c alpha divided by total c beta minus c alpha so by this rule you can calculate the weight percentage of alpha and beta now this is again uh, same type of diagram is given here again you can calculate this okay so i will not talk about this because this is a question which is part of this i can say so now let's move to next diagram i can say okay so next diagram is nothing but it is a part of iron carbon diagram okay iron carbon diagram ka part hai ye and this is i can say eutectoid point okay eutectoid point and the composition at eutectoid is eutectoid point is perlite or perlite i can say perlite okay so this is perlite and this is eutectoid point this point is eutectoid point and here the composition is perlite so eutectoid point in iron carbon diagram occur at 0.76 percentage of carbon and here this point is basically at 0.022 percent of carbon now what is we have to going to do that if they are basically given the composition is given this okay this is given that at c not dash composition or c not composition what is the perlite present i can say what is perlite present and what is alpha present okay whatever the structure here form suppose at at this point any structure is present so in this structure perlite is also there and alpha is this so this alpha is nothing basically it is also called ferrite or if i basically more conveniently talk it is called pro eutectoid alpha i can say okay pro eutectoid alpha pro eutectoid ferrite or alpha i can say okay so ye perlite bhi present hai iske andar and alpha bhi present hai to wo puchhenge that how much percentage out of total 100% perlite is there by weight and how much percentage pro eutectoid alpha is present to usko kaise dekhna hai aapne ye point इसके बीच में एक लाइन ड्रॉ की एंड इसकी टोटल लेंथ इज टी प्लस यू एंड इफ यू हैव टू कैलकुलेट द वेट परसेंटेज ऑफ परलाइट सो परलाइट इज प्रेजेंट एट दिस लाइन सो यू हैव टू टेक द ऑपोजिट टू दिस दैट इज टी सो हेर यू कैन सी टी एंड टोटल इज टी प्लस यू इफ दे आर आस्किंग दैट अल्फा सो अल्फा रिच रीजन इज दिस दैट इज लेफ्ट साइड रीजन इज अल्फा रिच रीजन यू हैव टू टेक ऑपोजिट टू दैट दैट इज यू सो यू डिवाइड बाई टी प्लस यू सिमिलरली ओके नाउ इफ दे हेयर बेसिकली गिवन कंपोजिशन हेयर इट इज गिवन हेयर कंपोजिशन बट इफ कंपोजिशन इज गिवन ऑन दिस साइड ऑफ यू टेक्टॉर्ड पॉइंट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव टॉक्ड अबाउट लेफ्ट साइड नाउ राइट साइड इफ कंपोजिशन इज गिवन ऑन दिस साइड देन वट इज द फॉर्मूला देन perlite is present but now not alpha but present is there but here iron carbide to yahan pe iron carbide ki baat aa jayegi so this region is rich in iron carbide and this rich uh, region is rich in perlite and this composition is given so if they are asking about weight percentage of iron carbide so you have to take opposite to that that is v v divided by v plus x here you can see if they are asking about perlite you have to take opposite to that that is x so x divided by v plus x okay so friends this is all about i can say Uh, the lecture that i have given you and in this i have just mentioned you that how to calculate the uh, how to use lever rule i can say in phase diagram okay it is very simple type of video and i will in next video add the volume concept also in this rule thank you very much and please like the video share the video and subscribe the channel thank you very much friend